Evictions started back up last month after a ban put in place at the start of the pandemic. This has led to a whole lot of questions and we are working to get you answers. We've got Laura Hogshead, the Chief Operating Officer of the North Carolina Office of Recovery and Resilience, and Sharon Barlow, the Guilford County Deputy Services, Social Services Director here. Uh, to get your question answered, all you have to do is text it over to us at 336-379-5775. So first off, is there help out there for people if they might get evicted, Laura? Yes, there is. So the HOPE program is still accepting applications from tenants that are behind on rent and utilities. And that's for folks that are outside of Guilford and Forsyth counties and in the 88 counties that we serve. But we are still accepting applications. And what do you have to do to qualify for that, Laura? So you need to be a renter. You need to be at 80% of area median income or below. And you need to attest that you have had a financial impact from COVID. Sharon, what are some of the issues that you've seen with people trying to qualify for this so far? We've actually seen a lot of people qualify for this program. Our um, uh, eligibility requirements are very similar to what Laura just stated. You need to be a renter. You need to have had a um, uh, directly or indirectly a hardship due to COVID and need to be um, uh, below the 80% um, AMI. And, um, you know, we want to work with folks to get their documentation in, and, and we do that in a variety of ways. So we're trying to make it just as simple as possible for people to get the help they need. When you say AMI 80%, what's a good example of what that is? So for a family of four, um, uh, the AMI in Guilford is uh, 52,900. So having an income in that level, um, we encourage folks to call if they have any question about whether they're uh, eligible for this program and we can help walk them through, um, you know, the number of folks in their family, uh, their situation, uh, you know, if they're receiving unemployment, um, all of those kind of things factor in. So if there's any question, if somebody um, might qualify or they just want to talk through options, we're happy to do that as well. So someone just wrote in, is it true HOPE program is not in Guilford County? That is true. So because Sharon has her own funds for this program, the Guilford County residents and Forsyth County residents should apply to their county program. And the HOPE program is for those counties that don't have their own program. So we are currently operating in 88 counties. But it does basically the same thing. It's just a few different right. rules and procedures. That's right. Correct. So if you're not in Guilford County and you want to apply for the HOPE program, how do they, you, they reach out to do that? <laughs> So you can do it one of two ways. You can go to our website, hope.nc.gov, and you can fill out the application yourself in about 10 to 15 minutes, or you can call our hotline, which is 888-9-ASK-HOPE, and you can be walked through the application by one of our call center representatives. And how long does this process normally take? So from, pay from application to payment, we are right now at around 20 days. And so it's not an onerous process and it's a very fast process, especially for federal money. It's certainly the fastest process that I've ever seen federal money flow through. These days, it seems hard to prove why someone is out of work. Uh, does that matter why they're out of work? No, we just ask for, you know, we ask for someone to attest that they've had a coronavirus impact and that can be losing hours at work. That can be skyrocketing healthcare costs or increased childcare responsibilities. It doesn't have to be that you've lost your job. What about people who need help with utilities? How do they get that? So they can apply the same way for the HOPE program. It's on the same application and I'll let Sharon answer for Guilford. Very similar for, uh, for the Guilford CARES Act program. Utilities apply the same way. Um, you can also call 336-641-3000. Um, you can apply online, and that is guilfordcountync.gov, and the application is there. You can also come to either our Greensboro or High Point office, uh, 1203 Maple Street in Greensboro, or 325 East Russell Street in High Point. We can take um, online, 
phone call applications, walk-in applications. We're happy to help people walk through that for both rent and utilities. Laura is exactly right in terms of it doesn't have to be um, unemployment that caused you to be in this situation. It could be that you were out of work just for three weeks due to COVID. It could be that you've had additional childcare costs, additional um, folks now living in your home uh, because somebody else lost a job. Um, so uh, lots and lots of situations will qualify for this program. Well, we have a lot more questions coming in. We're going to get to those right after this break and send your questions in. It's 336-379-5775. We'll be right back.